Hello and welcome back to more Let's Play Kingdom Hearts because this isn't Majora's Mask like I was about to say. Right, so in the previous episode we were able to get back to the top of the tea party room but I failed and I fell back to the ground. Right, so now we have to figure out a way in order to get to the top half of this room without falling so that I can get the chests that are up there because most likely there's a Dalmatian something through whatnot. Right. So, uh, yeah, nothing much has happened since the last time I recorded an episode. No, no new events. Besides, I, I went to go work on those watercolored leaves again today. Right oh, so. Ooh, a frost shard. And what's this? Another frost shard. Ba, 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 dun, 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 dun. I'm gonna be checking my Facebook right here. Give me a second. Let's see who's on. Hello? Amanda's on. Let's tell Amanda hi. Good evening. What's this? An Ocrylium. Clium. Or Corillium, I believe is what it's called. Oh, here we go. Well, this is a lot simpler of a way than uh, what I was trying to do. And there's 19, 20, and 21. And what are you? An Erosia G. Oh, apparently I'm a cutie. I am quite sexy, though. Thank you, Amanda. Ooh, we get some... Some shrooms here. That's always a good start to my my video. All right, I have to figure out the, these different things because honestly, I suck at this. Okay, that's two. Can I get three of them? Yes, I can. What did I get? A thunder shard. Not what I was expecting, but still good. Radio. Okay, I'm not gonna make that comment on YouTube. Amanda needs to, you know, keep it clean. Keep it clean, Amanda. Thunder. And at this point, she has no clue I'm actually talking to you, to her while videoing. So, oh well. Uh, well, I actually did pretty good on these three. Usually, they're so close together though that you do one thing and it will attack all of them. And then they all, like, port away, and then you've messed up on the first one, so it sucks anyway. Right, that's all the chests that I can think of here that I've not uh, gotten thus far. So we're going to be heading on to the deep jungle. Wolf drive! Because normal driving is for fools. And I want to make these videos as quick as possible. I don't know, let's look up my horoscope for the day. There's something to talk about. Come on, uh, where is it? I have a, an app on Facebook. Bum, 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 bum. Jump into the trees and just swallow. Oh yeah, because there's a mini game here that you can actually do. I forgot to mention that. You can gather fruits while doing the vine thing. And if you set a record or whatnot for three turns, I believe it is, then uh, you get, like, different items. And one of them, I believe, should be an aquarium or whatever that the name is for that. Nine. And where's ten? Ooh. Am I going to go through this unharmed? I think I have. That's the first time in this Let's Play I actually went through that unharmed. 
And it was the time that I was being timed, and, you know, it was supposed to be difficult. That's lame. Anyway, uh, I was looking for my horoscope, but it seems to have disappeared. Where's my app? Horoscopes. Anyway, if you remember correctly, there's a couple items that I need to get here. Uh, we still need to find the Trinity, which uh, is in the cave type area at the very end of the of the level. This is not my horoscopes. What the heck? Where is my horoscopes? Bingo! Robot unicorn attack. Pocket god. Castle age. Not my horoscopes. I'm getting ticked. Come on now. There we go. Took me a minute to find it. What is my horoscope for the day? Uh, today's the 21st. People can be brilliant about some things and dumb about others. Now you're in a position to judge, but later someone should be judged. Su but later someone could be judging you. Toot your own horn and remember to give others credit too. Thank you. What's my lucky time of the day? 4 p.m. It's 7. Darn. Radio. I don't know what I was doing at... Well, actually, I do remember what I was doing it for. Well, that's beside the point. Radio. Amanda doesn't want to talk to me. Fine, Amanda. Be that way. We'll find something else to talk about. I need to talk about my best friend anyway. Now we're after the White Trinity. And honestly, that's... That's one of the only items that I can think that we missed. Was the Trinity mark here. When going through and actually reading up on... The HD remake of 1.5 for Kingdom Hearts. This was the first place that I saw. And that's what really made me think that it was going to be awesome. Because of, like, how graphic-wise it looked compared to what I had gone through here. Because it really does look brilliant. Oh, come on, I don't want to go through all this. But I will if I have to. Can I fly over? Can I fly? Yes, I can. Da -da 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 -da. There's my Trinity mark. And then we have to go through the whole bit of walking back. Wonderful. Open up. Aquarium. Let's see, it's 7.30. Yeah, it wasn't exactly 7. But... Still, it's not four o'clock either. Da -da 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 -da. Let's see, what's next? We could go to the Olympus Coliseum, but I don't need to at this point. We'll be end we'll end up doing that later on anyway. Unless I want to just grab the White Trinity, but still, there's no point in just grabbing it and coming out. Ba -da 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 Alright. Let's see. Where else do we need to go? We could go to Halloween Town. We could go to Agrabah. Actually... Do we need anything in Agrabah? Yes. I had to look at my list there. Yeah, 
Yeah, if I if I pause here a couple of seconds, the reasoning behind it is is I'm looking at my list, seeing where each each thing is at, like what Dalmatians I actually need. So, according to my list, there's a few around this area, most likely. 101 Dalmatians. We got 78 now, and we got 6 here in Agrabah, which means 2 chests that we need to find. Now, you could talk to Carpet, but we're not going to do that right now. Uh, because that actually leads off to a hidden boss that I may or may not do a bonus episode on later. The hidden bosses are, of course, hidden, so they're optionable. And you don't actually have to do them, nor do they really give you anything if you do do them anyway. As far as I remember. And some of the hidden... I can't really call them hidden bosses because some of the hidden bosses that I was mentioning aren't really hidden at all. It's just that you have to do something to uh, be able to do them. In this case, in order to do the hidden boss here, you have to just uh, lock... The, well... We've not locked the Calabastian Keyhole. I think it's just, uh, defeat Riku. Or, if not, then it's um, just to, to lock the Keyhole. In Calabastian. Alright. I'm trying to open this chest, but the Heartless are being relentless. They're just attacking me. Da -da -da. There's another chest, a mithril. Sorry, I was quiet there, just talking to Amanda, who actually decided to reply. Yeah, I know my singing skills aren't the best, but... Right now, it's the best you guys are getting, commentary-wise. Dectra chain. I really like the Disney movies. For a while, Aladdin used to be one of my favorite Disney movies ever. And honestly, it is still hard to say which is my favorite of all the Disney movies because there's just so many good ones in my opinion. And being a huge Disney fan, you know, Kingdom Hearts is a really good game. And it also increases your love for each individual uh, 
each Disney film and honestly you can't really hate on a Disney movie right well I'm heading off into the desert to go back to the cave of wonders so we will go through that next time uh, if you like the video please subscribe and like I said next time we're gonna be going through the cave of wonders so until then see you all then